Hello and welcome to our reading lesson for today. We are going to learn a, about a new sound. And if you noticed, when we were learning about our long vowels, we skipped over the E. We talked about A, I, O, and U. But we never talked about our friend E because he doesn't follow the typical pattern for long vowels. The way that he works is he has to have two E's next to each other to say E. So today we're going to just look through these pictures and we're going to color the ones that say E. Are you ready? Okay, so we're going to start up here with this. What is this? A three. Does three start with, or does it have the sound E in it? Three. Do you hear E? I do, so I'm gonna color that one in. Okay, looking at our next one. We have a ring. Well, I finished coloring the three and I want you to think about whether you hear E in ring. Are you thinking? Do you hear E and ring or ing? Oh, or ing. Now, we kind of hear it, but let's think about his chunks. Er and ing. And we've talked about ing. Ing is made up of three letters that work together to say that sound. And the way that it's spelled is I-N-G. So yes, we kind of hear the E sound in there, but he's in disguise, doesn't really say E. So let's move on to the next one. This is a sheep. Do, do you hear the double E in sheep? Sheep. Oh, I hear a double E in sheep, so I'm gonna color him in. And I'm not gonna color him all in because I want him to be black, or I want his wool to be white, but I'm gonna color his head in. Sheep, it has that E sound. Okay, moving on to our next one. We have tree. Tur e. Does that have the E sound in it? Yes, it does. Tur E. So I'm gonna go ahead and color that one in. I don't know where my other green is, but this green will work. Okay. So we have how many so far that have had the E sound in it? I'm gonna come over and put an X on this guy. We have three so far. We've had three, sheep, and tree. Great job, let's go to the next one. This is a wheel, wheel, wheel. Does it have the E sound in it? It does. So let's go ahead and color the wheel in. Do, 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 do. Okay. What do we have next? Feet. Does it have the E sound in it? Yes, it does. So we're gonna color it in. I'm gonna color it super fast. I know, oh, you can see it colored. I thought you weren't gonna be able to see it. Okay, next we have a wrench. Er, eh, inch. Er, eh, inch. Does that say the right E sound we're looking for? We're looking for something to say E. Does it say E anywhere in it? 
<gasps> no, it doesn't. So what should Mrs. Arnold do? Yup, I should cross it out. Okay, next we have a B. B. Do you hear that E sound? I do. Should I color it? Yes, I should. Let's do yellow. Yellow. Black. Black. And he needs a little gray on his wings. Okay, next, what are these called? The part inside that it's pointing to. Seeds, does seed have E in it? Seeds, oh, it does. Okay, gotta color my seeds. My red went missing too, so we have a pinkish apple. That's okay though. Not sure where Mrs. Arnold's crayons went. But I'm sure you'll forgive me that my apple is not red. Okay, on to the next one. We have shell. Shell. Do you hear an E sound in shell stretched out? Stretch it one more time. Did you hear E? I heard eh. I did not hear E, so what should I do? Cross it out. Okay, next we have cup. Stretch it out. Stretch it one more time. Did you hear E? I didn't either. What do we have next? A yo-yo. Stretch it out for me. One more time. Yeah. oh yeah. oh Did you hear E? Nope, I didn't either. Okay, our last one, a horn. Stretch it out. Horn. Does it say E? Nope. So, how many E words did we see? How many did we find? Seven. We found seven E words today. Great job. Now we're going to move on to this page. And what we're going to do is we have to decide whether he does say E or doesn't say E. Very similar to what we just did. Are you ready? Okay. So our first picture is a truck. I want you to stretch that word out. Stretch out truck. I'm gonna set you down for just a second to cut it. So stretch out truck. Are you stretching it? Stretch it one more time for me. Great job. Now, did you hear the E sound inside of it? Did you hear it say E at all? I did not, I did not hear it say E. So what we're going to do is he gets put on the thumbs down side because he does not say E. Okay, here's our next one, ready? B, stretch it out, B, E. Did you hear E? 
Yes, we did. So we're gonna add him to the thumbs up side. Strawberry. 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 Do you hear E? I kind of hear an E at the end, but I'm gonna have to tell you a secret. He's in disguise again. He doesn't spell it with the double E, so we're gonna put him on this side, even though we do kind of hear him. Okay, next we have fish. Fish. Do you hear E? Nope, over here he goes. Next we have seed. Do you hear E? Seed. Did you hear it? Yes, we did, over here. Next we have feet. Feet. Did you hear E? Yes, so on this side it goes. Okay, next we have lettuce. 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 Did you hear E? I heard an E sound like eh, but I did not hear a double E in there where he says E. So over here, let's see, can I squeeze him in there? Okay, last word, wheel. 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 Did you hear E? Yes, we did. So over onto the E side it goes. Okay, we sorted all our words by whether they said E or they did not say E. And with that E saying, we had to have the spelling of the double E. I hope you learned so much about our double E today. And I will see you all in the next video. Bye.